Hello everyone, it's Crystal from Beautifully Broken Crafts Hauls and more again, and I am here with part two of a Dollar Tree Haul. You see my arm moving right now, it's because I have a visitor on my lap. The fat cat, as I call Munch, aka Loki, which is Peyton's cat, who does not leave me alone ever half the time. Look at my hair, what is happening here? So, yeah, he is up my butt because she's sleeping. And it's like 4 o'clock in the afternoon, if not later at this point. But whatever. So long as she gets her schoolwork done and her chores, I, I've i given up on the fight of getting her up at a normal time anymore. Yeah, I'm just going to say it. And that's what happens. As you, you know, I have Marcus, and he's 22 almost. He'll be 22 in May was harder on him than her because you just start getting tired you know what I'm tired I'm tired of fighting or repeating myself I feel like I should have recorded myself when I was yelling at Mark for all his stupid choices and then I could just play it back for her with her stupid choices but I didn't do that so here we are anywho Let's get into this haul, y'all, because you didn't come here to listen to me ramble on. So, it's going to be a little difficult with Spatty over here on the left. Well, let's just get into this uh, right quick. Um, excuse you. So, the first thing I'm going to show you guys, and I've seen other people haul this before in the past, but I have never seen them at my Dollar Tree until today. It's the glass paintbrush markers. Um, it says, great for glass, ceramic, porcelain. And then it says on the back, it's water-based. Great for design work on mugs, glasses, ceramic, porcelain, and other non-porous surfaces. The long, flexible nylon fiber brush nib allows you to create from super fine to thick, bold strokes just by adjusting the pressure or the angle. For adult use, not a toy. For decorative and crafting use only, not intended for use on skin. Wash skin with soap and water to remove any incidental contamination. It doesn't say anything about, like, care of the product once you write on it. But I just picked up two different ones. So I picked up this one in purple. And this does say it's a Greenbrier brand. Which I'm color factory. I'm kind of surprised by it. And I picked up one in black. So there are those. I know this cat's going to get mad because I'm going to be moving around. But he's going to have to deal with it. Oh, if you watched part one of my haul, I couldn't find the box for the cold medicine I picked up, Peyton. But I found it. It's the Value Health Combo Pack. So you get 12 total soft gels. Six soft gels of daytime. Six soft gels of nighttime. And it's multi-symptom. So it has a pain reliever, fever reducer, it's relief of headache, fever, sore throat, minor aches and pains, nasal congestion, cough, and sinus pressure. Also, cough, sneezing, runny nose. So that's what I picked the pain, but she has, this is empty right now, she actually has the sleeve in her room. Okay, back to the haul. So, I did pick up, I finally found these tinsel hearts. You get two pieces, so I picked up two packs of these. I'm just going to show you the one, though. So, there's those. I thought those were super cute. They only had this pink color. I don't know if they've ever had a red color out or not, but this is all they had. But I'm into the pinks this year, so I'm okay with that. And it has, like, a little ribbon bow on the front of them. There are those. And then in this hand, I have some foam eggs, because they only have, like, one little stand of Easter stuff out so far at my Dollar Tree. And this is just 12 pieces. I don't think I'm going to leave these as is. I'll probably end up changing them. But I just picked them up. And they do have like little hangers on them out of ribbon. So there are those. And they're glittery of course because it's Dollar Tree. So why would it not be? Where am I putting this? I don't know. Oh god, grab this bag. Okay. Sorry for any rattling noise you guys hear of the bags, but I've been getting lazy and haven't been separating anything, and I apologize, but 
that's like two extra jobs then because then I got to separate it all in the reusable bags and show you guys and then I got to separate it again to put it all away so no offense but I'm a busy woman over here sometimes so I just don't have time for all that anyhow I did pick up some pump spray bottles you get two pieces from the crafter square I needed these for a DIY I have coming up so there are those I did pick up these cute little I think they're raccoons by the fuzzy friend you get two pieces so the lighter one says you and the darker one says me and I was gonna give these to Peyton for Valentine's Day and then I just picked up this three piece of gift bags from Dollar Tree to put her gifts in as well because why not I did finally find these little heart picks that have the alligator clip on the end. So there's three hearts on it. They're super glittery. And here's the pick. I mean, the clip. Um, they just got these. They just put these out this weekend at my store. So I grabbed two of those. Um, I did get from the beauty aisle this pink sugar lip scrub by global beauty care Let's see if i can read any of this because you know sometimes i'm like huh oh, can't see but that's not in english so It just says, this scrub is formulated to gently remove dead skin cells for smoother lips. Pink sugar gently exfoliates skin for a smoother look and feel. And you get 1.7 ounces in this. This is all they had in terms of lip care in a jar like this. And it says it comes with a spatula. Let me make sure. And this is good for six months after you open it. I see that little I'm trying to not get the glare but that little jar there that means it's six months it's good after six months of opening it sorry fatty sorry much you guys think that's abusive when I call the cat fatty but he is fat because like he will eat people food he will eat the dog's food he will eat his food he's just a hog He's worse than our dog. Oh, that rhymes. So here's the jar, and it does have the spatula in here. As usual, I'm on the verge of dropping it because that's how it is. Good Lord, open. It smells good. Okay. It smells okay. That's what it looks like. So it does look super sugary. Probably have Peyton try this because her lips get dried out bad. Mine not so much. And then I also found the name brand. This driver size. I don't even know what the hell that means. 2XL spoke earbuds. And I'm going to give a pack of these to Peyton because she's always looking for earbuds. So those are, there you go. No, they're not wireless, but that's not a big deal. And for $1.25, why not? And then they finally got the ceramics out in my Dollar Tree to paint. So I picked up, it's got glitter fallout everywhere from those picks. Um, the little mail truck that says love delivery on this side. And you see the little envelopes there. There's the front of it. It's super detailed. And then on this side just has the envelopes and two hearts. So I thought that was super cute to paint. And who else is in this bag? And then I got this cupcake. I think I got two of these to paint. It says Be Mine on the wrapper. I thought that was super cute. I got all the sprinkles and all that. So, those are just repeats. So, like stuff you guys already see. Okay, next bag. He's giving me dirty looks every time I bend over. 
I did pick up this 18 piece of foam roses. This was the only color they had in my store. He's got glitter all over him. Um, it's the white roses, but that's fine. And if I wanted to change the color, if like I absolutely need to change the color, I can. I'll just paint them or whatever. But there's those. And I only bought one pack of those. They did finally get the Valentine's Day scarves out. So I only picked up this print and I grabbed two of them. Just to use it as like table, excuse me, runners so that it's just got hearts on it. And it says like Happy Valentine's Day, Be Mine, Hugs and Kisses, XOXO. So I just grabbed two of those. Mm. Last thing in this bag is this little wood cutout. It's an envelope that says Love You. It's the heart there. I thought that was cute. Oh. Bag number three. And then I have one more bag after this. He's digging his nails into me. That's not nice. Okay, what do we have? We have, I finally found the mop and broom holder anti-slip rubber clasp to prevent your brooms and mops from falling. Space saving, best solution for mops, brooms, rakes, and other tool organizers. This is all they had. They didn't have the um, black one that's lawn and garden. Not that I've seen it. It's by Essentials. But I thought this would be good to have for my cleaning supplies. So I can put a broom or a mop in that one, and then that one, and then here hang whatever. So, and it has a picture here with an example of what to put on there. So for $1.25, thought that wasn't bad. I did pick up this bag of Haribo um, Gold Bears. It's the Valentine's Day edition, so it's the red and white ones only, which are my two favorite flavors. So the red, I want to say, is strawberry. Yep. No, raspberry. And the white ones are pineapple, which the pineapple ones are my absolute favorite. And these are 100 calories for 13 pieces, zero fat, five milligrams of sodium, 23 grams of carbs, 14 sugar, grams of sugar, 20, uh, 14 added sugars, and 2 grams of protein. So I thought that was a good deal. And like I said, those are my two favorite flavors. So I grabbed those. Those were at the checkout. And then I grabbed, oh, by Munch, another pack of the Yardley of London disposable washcloths. You get 18 of them. Enriched with aloe vera, chamomile, and vitamin E. These are good to have on hand at any time. So, just have an extra pack. Actually, that was the last pack of those that they had. And then I found this really cute book of stickers. You get 250 stickers. I'm scared this is going to fall. I'm sitting Indian style in my chair. Um, and it's just, there's the cover. This is by Greenbrier. I just liked that it had like all these little, it has the coffee, the ice cream, the cake. I thought they were just cute. All different kinds on every page. Cupcakes, pizza. Look at that one. What does that say? Coffee for life. Yes. So, and for 250 stickers, that wasn't a bad deal, in my opinion. Super cute. Mm, that's funny. The pizza says true love. Which most of us love pizza. I should decorate some Peyton's gift bag for Valentine's Day with the tacos. Me and she absolutely loves tacos. And this one's just got animals. A, a whole random collection of things on it. This one just has different words like today, love, moment, on, off, movies, good talent, enjoy, home, peace, now, to-do list. Oh, these are cute. The little cupcakes and cookies on this page. And that's it. Okay.
Next in this bag, I did find, and I was so excited to find these because I think they are stinking adorable. Stay, stay, stay. Are these sticky note collections? So I got the alpaca one first. So here it is. Fold it up and then you open it like this. And it's got all these different pieces of paper in it. So on this side, you get two sets of sticky notes. You get the alpaca sticky note here. Then you get a little blank sheet with an alpaca. And then you get all of these little sticky notes. So they're in strips like this. So I thought that was super cute. And then they also had the one in cherry. The cherry. These are the only two I've seen. And I thought this was adorable too. Same thing. Sticky note, sticky note, sticky note. These are different though. Sticky note, sticky note. List more sticky notes. Maybe we'll give this one to Peyton. I don't know. She doesn't really care about stationery or like that. Um, I also picked up one of the ceramic mailboxes that you paint yourself. So here's this side. It says love with the little flag. There's the front of it. And there's the other side. It's just got hearts. And then that side looks the same. Come on, focus, camera. There we go. Well, that was cute. And here's the other cupcake I got to paint. So. And then last things in this bag. I found these tiny Zen Gardens and I remember Mark saying he wanted one. So I just picked up one for him and one for Peyton. So it's just a Zen Garden. Here's what the front of it looks like. And here's the back. And it says... Does travel leave you frazzled? Carry along the mini Zen gardening kit and you'll have tr tranquility wherever you go. Based upon a centuries old tradition, the kit includes a base, sand, rocks, and miniature rake. I have a bigger version of one of these upstairs in my room that I had from Five Below. And it had like a little Buddha and all that on it too. Okay, last bag you guys. Um, more Easter stuff. I just picked up the five piece of egg picks in here. So you get a yellow one, a pink one, orange, purple, and blue. I don't know that I'll leave those the same or not. I also found some faux carrots and it comes in a four piece and I only just picked up this one package of those. I also, because I don't think I found these yet, so I got the DIY... Uh, wooden heart stickers, 10 pieces from Dollar Tree. Because I think they just brought these out. I'm pretty sure I don't have these in my bins across the way from me. And then I only got one cake topper. They had this one that's a heart that says love. And then they also had the Happy Valentine's Day one. But I just picked up this one. I don't really feel like those are really worth the dollar twenty-five, But I still bit the bullet. I did get this galvanized cupcake. Thought it was super cute. They also had the lips and the galvanized envelope, but I did. I got the wood envelope, so I was like, that was that was enough for me. And then they finally came out with the foam glittery hearts. So I just picked up the two of them. They only had red. The glitter fall out. It's not horrible compared to those tinsel hearts in that. Um, not holiday related. I can't believe they stuck this in the bag with this other thing. I just bought a mini crow, a crowbar because I thought this would be good to have in my stash of tools in case I need it for anything or if I need to bonk somebody over the head with it. I'm kidding. Maybe. I'm just kidding. And last but not least, they had the ceramic Valentine's Day gnome which has glitter all over it from them stinking hearts. So his hat just has little heart impressions on it. Come on. I think this light's too bright. This new light. Do I have the clicker with me over here for it? No. So I'll do my best. To, there we go. His heart has little, his heart, his hat has little heart impressions on it. And 
then he's holding a heart. Oh, I just thought he was super cute. Okay, you guys, that's it for my part two Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed everything I found. Let me know in the comments which find I had shown you guys was your favorite. Um, again, please, if you're not subscribed already, do please do so. Make sure you give me a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel. Hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Comment below. Like, share, all the goodness. I've repeated myself, but you know I'm a mess. I'm always a hot mess over here. I love you all so much. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Stay ha happy, healthy, safe, and blessed. I will talk to you guys soon, and I love you all so much.